Citing from the Royal Navy website, the Operational Advantage Center, the Royal Navy's lead organization on tactical development, has staged an extensive Martlet missile firing trial in Wales, using a Wildcat helicopter from Yeovilton-based 815 Naval Air Squadron to test the weapon to its maximum ability. Improving lethality and operational advantage in support of frontline operations is at the core of what the center stands for. And the trials dubbed Triton's Arrow has proven key to 815 NAS better defining the capability of the Martlet missile. And a first for the squadron, it also involved a successful firing against an aerial target. The Martlet has been used on frontline operations over the past few years, but the latest testing, supported by 744 NAS and 825 NAS, was to see how the missile system could be used further in a variety of circumstances to combat a range of threats and how it can continue to protect and support the Royal Navy's fleet. The trials, conducted over two weeks, involved a range of challenging tests for 815 NAS and industry partners Thales and Kennedy Q. It saw the Martlet put through its paces and prove its ability to neutralize the equivalent of small, fast-moving craft from speedboats and jet skis at range and airborne threats such as drones. So far, a Wildcat has fired the Martlet successfully on frontline operations, including hitting an inflatable target while embarked on Portsmouth-based HMS Defender in 2021 as part of the UK's carrier. Strike group deployment, and now against moving targets on the water and against a Banshee drone, the first air-to-air -air Martlet firing by a UK helicopter.